The Me and the Boys meme uses villains from the 1960s Spider-Man cartoon. You've got the Rhino, the Vulture, Electro, and the Green Goblin. All of these villains have been featured in modern Spider-Man movies or games, but they definitely look far more threatening in their newer iterations than the older animation we see here. The first person to use the meme was Reddit user Cobe1712, who actually photoshopped the image of the Rhino in with the other characters. The original image came from episode 19 of the 60s series, which was called To Catch a Spider Slash Double Identity. It could be argued that the appeal of the meme stems from the normal person approach to the cartoon villains. None of these guys look actually dangerous. They just look like a bunch of boys wearing Halloween costumes having a good time. This is a far cry from the modern interpretations of these villains, which look far too sci-fi and powerful to be relatable. The basic animation of these villains also instills a sense of nostalgia and warmth, creating an instant sense of connection with the meme and oneself. It brings to mind shows such as Harvey Birdman and the Space Ghost Coast to Coast, which utilise retro imagery to portray a certain nostalgic mood. However, the phrase, me and the boys, has been used extensively through meme culture to demonstrate the camaraderie and silliness men exhibit when spending time with each other, and this meme is not the first time we have seen it become popular. For example, me and the boys heading to fishing became insanely popular last year, and was incredibly silly. In fact, I would argue that much of the success of the me and the boys meme is due to the recent popularity of the boys locker room memes that flooded most of May. These memes demonstrate a similar camaraderie and zaniness that accompanies the me and the boys meme, warming up the internet for jokes about doing fun stuff with the lads. What meme would you guys like me to give a lesson in next? Let me know in the comments below.